Thousands of workers have walked off the job, shutting down six Queensland coal mines. The Premier is calling on the federal government to intervene over fears we could lose business offshore. The Bowen Basin is at the heartland of Queensland's mining boom, but production has ground to a halt. More than 3,500 workers walking off the job for a week. Any industrial action in the Bowen Basin should send a shiver down the spine of every Queenslander because it's, it, all of us depend on the money that the coal industry makes for the schools and the roads and the hospitals and the services that state governments provide. While workers and their union battle it out with BHP Mitsubishi Alliance, there's growing pressure for the federal government to intervene. At a time when we are vulnerable, I, I, th I think it is a, a very much a test of the, of the industrial relations system at a federal level. Ongoing industrial action over the past 18 months has already cost Queensland in excess of $50 million in lost mining royalties. The Premier fears it could frighten big business offshore. Right now, I know those international companies are looking at places like Mozambique and Mongolia, uh, and uh, they will go where they, th where they feel they can uh, you know, get, a, get a better deal. Analysts say with the price of thermal coal falling on the global market, BHP Mitsubishi Alliance can afford to ride out the strike action for now. But politicians say Queensland can't afford it. Act like adults and, and, and bring this, this thing to a resolution. The union says the fight isn't over money, but improved working conditions, including safety, housing and job security. Lisa Goddard, 10 News.